And an update to our report yesterday. The Maryland worker who didn't apply for unemployment insurance benefits received five more debit cards, bringing the total to 23. The debit cards were in other people's names, but sent to Dr. Keenan Cofield's address. He says he had been communicating with a potential investor. That person said he would receive cards in the mail, but when they were unemployment debit cards, he called us. The Department of Labor said they've blocked all the debit cards sent to him, as well as claims fraudulently filed in Dr. Cofield's name. The agency is actively investigating the case in coordination with the Maryland State Police, U.S. Department of Labor Office of the Inspector General, and the U.S. Attorney's Office. And you can watch the full report and find out more about the unemployment situation in our state at WMAR2news.com slash unemployment guide.